Tuesday, 8.45. We're headed to Atlanta, Nada. It's rough, it's rough as bricks. It's too rough to go on the bay. I wanted to go on the bay, but it's too rough. Today, we're trying out Maddie's waterproof plug so we can use our waterproof CTX phones. This thing comes in a 6 inch version. I had him make up a couple 20, I think they're 20 inches. So they tape along the bottom of the Knox. Come out here on the end and connect the CTX phones right here. I tried them yesterday when I got them in the yard. It works fine. And I got the Amal phones on here right now from the UK. Surf phones they call them. You see them. But looks okay. I am going to take some silicone and seal up all around this just in case. But I haven't got the silicone. I used the, I pulled my silicone tube out last night and it was dried up so I got to buy a new tube. I'm going to do the same thing to this end here. But we'll see how they go. Later today, I got my camera settings changed. I don't know if we hope that problem we had the other day. I hope that's rectified. Beaver went, uh, I guess he went early this morning when the tide was high. But you can see it's uh, some breeze. Northeast, east northeast, I think it was. It was northeast yesterday and east northeast today. Quiet, you Indians. But it comes in spells. Hey, hey! We're gonna have a big crop of figs, it looks like. Look at them. And it's just the first week in June. Fat, pretty figs in about a month. Or anyway, at least a month. I like them. Okay. That's all I got till we hit the land of Nada. Well, it's 9.30. Depositor's already here. Lots of them. Angry, angry, angry. I told you it would be with that weed breeze. We're gonna have to work up high. Beach is pretty flat today. Big waves. Nasty. Undertow. Out of 13. That could be a nice bottle cap. I brought my little scoop today so I wouldn't be losing all that little crap. Five cents! Look at five cents this morning. Look at that. Five cents. Damn, I just realized I left my pouch on. I'll have to put it in my other pouch. <coughs> Target number two is another 13. Another 13. And another nickel. Damn, look at that. Two nickels in a row. Nickel. Yeah. 
25 cent, I bet. Yep, 25 cents. Man, we're hitting them good today. 30 feet, 35 cents. Almost man's digging something. Two nickels and a quarter. This sounds like a penny, but it's not. I don't know what it is. It is a penny. A penny. Oh, yeah. I got a 20 here, but it's a little jumpy. Deep. I'm thinking junk now. That's what I'm thinking. I switched to all metal mode, it sounds like metal now, iron. But now my curiosity is up. I want to see what it is. Sometimes your curiosity drives you crazy, you know. Stand by a minute. A lot of dimes from some quarters, but I'm heading on a record number of dimes. This is a different tone. This is 11 right here. I don't know what this is going to be. It's the first 11 we've had today. of aluminum I think. Well we got another 13. And we got another nickel. Dug a 25. I thought it was a quarter, but it's not. It's some kind of big thing. You see it right there? Might be a watch. Might be an old watch. But I ain't sure. But I'm taking it down here now to wash it off. I'm working in and out right here, this part of the beach. That's what I said. I don't know what it is. Looks like a piece of junk now. I thought it was something different, but I don't know what it is. I have no idea either. Oh, 
13 out of the ground. Another nickel, it looks like. A lot of nickels today. How you making up, Bubba Man? I got one, man. Got one. Ah, good. Yeah, nice plain gold band. That's the best. I don't know what it is. I didn't look. I think it's got right in it too, I'm not sure. Fourteen K. Fourteen K right there. Frederick, what's the name for it? Frederick somebody. What's that? Frederick, got that. Got another thirteen. This time, I guess that's a quarter. Most of the quarters be coming out 28, 29. So I don't know what this is going to be. Yep, it's going to be a quarter. 25 more cents. What are you doing over here today? That's all I got. A lot of change. One little pendant, little thing, a pin for your shirt. From the some national park somewhere. Jenny just got a nice 14k. Yeah, he's ahead of me a little ways. Yeah, I got two pad, three pad the day before yesterday. Son of a deep too. Yeah, that's it. How about that ring that uh? Some weather moving in. It looks like they were calling for some showers maybe late this afternoon, but. Looks like it's trying to show up early or something. It's not overly hot today. I got on a long sleeve shirt, and I'm glad of it. The targets have dropped off going this way towards the pier. I thought I heard something. All right, that's it. I'll get back to you. Ain't no targets down this way like no, it is the other way. I'm gonna turn around right here, I think. Yeah. Let's go up there where them coins are. Yeah. And, uh, who's that in the orange? Is that FedEx to me? Yeah. I see. Oh. He said Dick's on the other side of the pier hunting. We're gonna turn around here and go back this way. More coins, more targets back this way. one out of the ground. Might be a fishing piece too, a piece of a fishing lure or something, you know? I don't think it's going to be very big. I see it now. Piece of crap is what it is.
Got a 14, 16. 14 to 16. I think it might be the first and second bottle cap of the day. Nope. Too low to be a bottle cap. I mean too low in the sand. I know it's right here somewhere. It must be something different. A piece of crap to me. There it is. Gladzilla. 25 pennies. I think it's 11 quarters. 18 dimes. I forgot the nickels. One, two, three, six, nine nickels. One piece of gray matter. This is the best of it for me. Grand Canyon National Park. Okay, Mumbles man got the Tiquito. I'll have his picture of his nut in a little bit. I got the farmer's market tomorrow afternoon, so I won't be able to go tomorrow. So, uh, Mumbles man CTX, he had to put it in the shop about a week ago. He got there on, he shipped it like Wednesday. It got there Friday. It was ready Friday afternoon. They shipped it back to him. He get it to, tomorrow less than a week turnaround from mine lab in Pennsylvania. It's a little pricey to get it fixed, but they put a new new uh, face on it, and I don't know what they did to it. I just know he said it was pricey. But he'll be spending with his CTX tomorrow just for a change, he said, if he goes. And I'm pretty sure he will. Okay, I'll get back to you. I may try and go tomorrow before the uh, farmer's market. I was uh, I just disconnected the uh, Mal phones from UK and I plugged in my Grey Ghost phones that I had for my CTX. And Denny said that the uh, Detector Pro ones were a little lower in sound. So I said, well, I like the Detector Pro. I'm going to hook them up and try them. But they're a lot lower. I mean, I tested, I tested a nickel and a quarter, and it was like forty percent less volume out of the Detector Pro than what out of Mouse. Surf phones, surf phones, he calls them. So I'm going to plug them back in and use them for a while. Just a tidbit of information for you. Here's a mumbles man's nut. We're pretty close on quarters. I got him on dimes and nickels. We're about even on pennies, it looks like. But look, he got a nice big fat yellow ticket. Six grams. You'll see a picture of it in a minute. There it is, uncleaned up. 14K Frederick Goldman, I think. Fancy, ain't it? I like it. Cleaned up nice. 6.4 grams. That's a medallion a beaver found, but it's plated. Okay, that's it. We live in the end. See you tomorrow, I hope. I'm planning to try to make it. I'm not sure it's going to be possible, but I'm going to try it. Good luck to everybody.